<laughs> Fuck what you heard. So, let me tell you guys about the show I'm currently doing. It starts with four children on stage uh, singing about how the Nazis are invading London. Um, so <laughs> it's a white farce. And so they decide to play hide and seek. Lucy gets into the wardrobe and comes out and says that it feels like winter. Everyone is like, are you kidding me? It's the middle of the summer. Professor Dickory comes out and is like, whoa, why are, why are we hating on Lucy right now? And so, of course, Edmund and Lucy go through the wardrobe and then they get into Narnia. A little random fact for you. Lucy comes through the wardrobe, Edmund comes through the wardrobe, and they're like, what? And then Edmund's like, do this. I'm about to go check some stuff out. And Lucy's like, what? And then Tumnus comes in, and Tumnus is like, I got some cake and candy in my apartment. And Lucy, who apparently has horrible parents, who never told her to not go with strangers, is like, you have cake here? Oh, hell yes! Let's do this! Tumness! Yes! And so she walks off with Tumness, and Edmund comes in, and he's like, where the fuck is Lucy? And then the witch comes in, and he's like, who are you? And he's like, I'm a boy, and she's like, well, now, shit. So, and she has to come up with a plan to keep, you know, the sons of Adams and the daughter, uh, the daughters of Eve from, I don't know, killing her. Um, Peter and Susan decide they're gonna hop they're gonna hop their happy asses through the wardrobe and Edmund comes in and is like, Oh my god, isn't this amazing? Lucy comes in and is like, There is a wolf and Edmund's like, You are lying, bitch and Lucy runs off crying. Enter the Beavers. And then the Beavers are like, We gotta go meet Aslan because you are a part of a plan and Peter is like, Hmm, I don't know how I feel about that. And they're like, no, you for real have to. There's really not an option. So they go. Meanwhile, Edmund goes back to the Queen, tries to get some more Turkish delight, gets shut down like, whoa. Um, her henchman drags in Tubness, turns him to stone. Then, and only then, does Edmund wake up and realize, hey, I'm talking to a witch. And she's like, oh. Of course I'm a witch. Tumnus is stone. Edmund is fucked. They, we switch back to the beavers. Uh, the beavers are like, oh my god, it's starting to be spring right now. So you know Aslan is back. Boom. First half of the play. Second half. The witch enters and she is not really happy that it is spring. Because I don't know, she is the queen of winter. Shocker. Um, Fenris, the head of the secret police, comes in and is talking about how, um, one of the Sons of Adams kills one of the wolves. And he's like, you know what? We gotta kill him. That's what we'll do. And instead of actually just going straight full face stab, which is what I would have done, obviously, um, she sings a song about it, and by the end of the song, of course, Aslan's army is approaching. Shocker. So, Edmund is saved, Aslan has this heart-to-heart -heart with Edmund, and Edmund is like, yeah, I'll try that. <laughs> Who cares? And then the witch re-enters, and Aslan is like, why are you here? And she's like, that bitch is a traitor, pointed at Edmund. That motherfucker is a traitor. And Edmund is like, oh, shit. I have already seen this bitch turn people to stone. And Aslan is like, don't even worry about it. I got this. Aslan comes back, and he's like, okay, Peter, you need to go get ready for battle. And Lucy is like, What's going on? Hassel is like, mm, I'm gonna hug you instead. Turns out, Aslan decided he's gonna sacrifice his lion life for Edmund, and the witch enters with the stone knife, and this is gonna be awesome. And so she proceeds to sing her song and then stab Aslan in the heart. Like, for real, in the heart. Aslan dies. That Aslan just got face stabbed.
And then Fenris comes in and beats the shit out of the two brothers. How bad their life sucks, right? And then as they're walking away, Aslan comes back. And he sings a great song about how great it is to be alive again. Um, motherfucker has a cape. A cape. A fucking go lame cape. Cape. Anyway, comes back, decides he knows how to fly, flies the two sisters and himself to the queen's courtyard, finds two brothers, uh, resurrects all the people that the witch has turned to stone, um, and then they enter the final battle. And in the final battle, <laughs> Susan fucking runs off stage <laughs> because that bitch is not ready to fight shit. Peter and Susan and Lucy fight the battle, and then Aslan finally attacks the witch. Edmund takes her wand, breaks it, she melts. Susan comes out of the dress, of course. And so we're at the end of the play, where everyone gets crowns and everyone's happy. Then they go back to the wardrobe, and that's the end of the show. <laughs>